What is going on, everybody? It is the Phantom Michael bringing you episode number 21 of the uh, Pokemon Ultra Sun Ultra Moon Randomized Soul Link Challenge. Of course, I'm joined with the one, the only, DJ Spinda. What's going on, guys? DJ Spinda here. Bro Skeddies, why don't we tell them what happened? Dude, in the last we are episode? feeling so much better now. <laughs> uh, yeah, we give them the explanation of what so, happened. So, okay. If you guys saw the little tag in thing at the end of the last episode, it was me attempting to complete a battle that we needed to complete. It was a grand trial battle, which I hope this never happens on a big grand trial battle again because mm -hmm. it was just supposed to be epic and uninterrupted. But we did kind of find out that for some reason or another, the move Water Pulse breaks my game. It crashes it every single time. And mm -hmm. now that we think about it and we go back, the the one of the old battles that crashed my game that had crashed my game before was was a, a Palkia, and I believe it used Water Pulse. So, mm -hmm. we're kind of narrowing it down. So, with that in mind, we were like, okay, what can we do here? We tried in the video snip that you guys saw where we, we realized that Jang Mo'o triggers this Wish Cache to use Magnitude instead of Water Pulse. So that gave us an opportunity to protect out of it, to uh, Dragon Tail out of it, but then it was, you know, the inevitable. It was the last Pokemon in the party. Once we went through the whole battle, we got to it, and the first move it used was Water Pulse. And that was even against the Jangmo. I switched Jangmo in at the start too. It said it was coming out. Mm -hmm. I switched it in, and the first move it locked in was Water Pulse, and it crashed the game. And so we had to go back to square one. What we decided to do is I went back to my box. I found that I had a Steeny in my box. I grinded it up to level like 31, 32 ish. It evolved into Zarina. Learned Trop Kick, all kinds of stuff. I went in, and it was, wasn't fast enough to outspeed it, and it still Water Pulse and crashed my game. So then, I was like, okay, am I going to have to grind it up more levels? Do I need to find a different graph, grass type? Or we're still trying to, you know, figure it out. And then I eventually discovered, hey, I have a Quick Claw in my bag. I mean, crazier things have happened. <laughs> you know, so I was like, I was like, I'll throw this Quick Claw on. I'm just going to try it one time, just see what happens. First time we try it, Quick Claw pops first turn. We knock it out one shot. Went through the rest of the battle, as you guys saw in that video clip, where I actually did win the battle other than... The wish cash crashing my game, which I guess in, in that theory he did, he he won the battle, I guess. Um, <laughs> but we ended up winning the battle by that logic. So I've got a Zarina in my box. It's like level 32, um, and I used it just for that that first wish cash. Then I used my rest the rest of my team as I did before, uh, and knocked out the rest of the team, including the Reshiram and all that other stuff. So for here sure, we man. are. That was some luck, man. That was some luck. Dude, Let's do a quick team recap luck. for the viewers. Then we're gonna get started. With the story here, up first on my squad, we have the Mighty Kane the Terror Cat with V Create, Double Kick, Lick, and Fire Fang. And Kane is linked with Megatron the Mega Metagross with Zen Headbutt, newly learned in the last episode. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, in the time that I did off screen to beat that trainer. <laughs> Metal Claw, Magnet Rise, and Bullet Punch. Up next, we have Flower the Lilligant with Absorb, Quiver Dance, Leech Seed, and Teeter Dance. Flower is linked with King, the Togekiss, with Water Pledge, Roar of Time, Yawn, and Sweet Kiss. Up next, we have Frost, the Weavile, with Avalanche, Faint Attack, Metal Claw, and Secret Power. And Frost is linked with Venom, the Salazzle, with Flame Burst, Toxic, Dragon Rage, and the newly learned Nasty Plot, which is going to be sweet. Mm. We have Flash up next with Water Gun, Mud Bomb, Discharge, and Bide. And Flash is linked with Quicksilver, the Mega Manetric, with Discharge, Thunder Wave, Quick Attack, and Howl. Up next, we have Toad, the oldest living member of our team, with Bubble Beam, Hypnosis, Earth Power, and Parish Song. And linked with Toad is Tina, the Pidgeot, with Tackle, Sand Attack, Gust, and Bolt Strike. And last but not least, we have Burt and Ernie, the throw, with V Create, Earth Power, Storm Throw, and Vital Throw. Burt is linked with Bay, the Jang Mo'o, with Dragon Tail, Headbutt, Protect, and Leer. Hmm. Let's get it, man. All right, we're going to go in here and see what happens to us. All right, Bay, you're going up front. Losing a pair today. What, what you got? Yeah, we're losing a pair today. <laughs> it's been too boring. We're losing a pair today. Oh, mm -hmm. I got to head down this way, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just checking out. Do I get free yeah, items yeah, for anybody? Yeah, yeah, free yeah. stuff? Phantom likes free things, please. I found some totem stickers off screen while I was running around trying to grind. Oh, I found a totem sticker right here, man. Hey, Hano Grand Resort. Oh, and I forgot. We got a free Pokemon too in the box for the here? totem stickers. <laughs> That's true, we did. I want the Pelipper. I, I would here. take the Pelipper. The, dude, this hotel would be awesome. Oh, it's a reporter. Eek! You aren't, aren't you? You're the famous 
Chewster? What? What? Chew. Oh, Chewster. you're Chewster. Oh, the Chewster. Chewster? I didn't know Chewster was a thing. The Pikachuster. You've become a household name with massive success in your latest film, Chewster! So the rumors that <laughs> Alola were true after all. You are spending your time off? What brought you here to Alola now? What if you made the movie in Gen 5? <laughs> I must ask you respect Mr. Master Chewster's privacy and let him vacation in peace. He, he will not be taking interviews at this time. Oh my god, this is, the, this is literally the dumbest thing ever. What? But everyone is just dying to know more about the famous Chewster's private life. You gotta spill. Shocker, do it. <laughs> Please, miss, we've already asked nicely once. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shoo! Step in or walk away? What should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Uh, that ain't my <laughs> business. I'm walking away. Peace. I, I kind of want to see what Step In does, but we'll, we'll check that out later. I, I know you're waiting for me. I'll step in on mine. Yeah, do it. I want to see what happens. I was <laughs> So, Please, we've come at last. Ah, but forgive me. I have yet to introduce myself. They call me Faba. Faba. <laughs> Faba. I've told you before that we should show you some place outstanding, right? Well, then... Wondrous place is Ether Paradise. Let me tell you all about Ether Paradise. Just as the name suggests, Ether Paradise is a veritable paradise for Pokemon that floats far out in the sea surrounding Alola. It's an artificial island made entirely by human technology by, for the protecting of Pokemon. Of course, I'm an adult who keeps his promises, so I will prove to you that I've told you is the absolute truth with a tour of the Ether Paradise. You will come, won't you? You damn right! Sure. I gotta see this. Good, good. Then you'll come with me. Ether Paradise will amaze you. Wait! Take me too! Ah! Even uh, Kahuna Olivia has come to see you off. As the Kahuna, I. Oh my god, all these people on my voice acting for. As Kahuna, I look <laughs> after all the trial goers who come to my island. They're like my own children. Not that I've got any. I've never even gotten married. Oh, like we needed to know this. Listen up, you two. Your greatest opponent is always yourself. Your greatest ally is the Pokemon beside you. Thanks. Are you coming too, Professor? Yeah, <laughs> you, bro. Got my own business to attend to. You go see all the amazing tech the Aether, that Aether's developing and tell me all about it later, yeah? That's right. I'll see you in the next island. Uh, uh, Ula Ula. Ula Ula Island, yeah? Then let's mate. Let's meet up at the Mele Garden. Yep, it's good. By Kala Island. Though I guess we come back any time we want to, huh? Well, then let us enjoy our adventure upon the grand vessel that will take across, take us across the high seas. By which I mean to say, the ferry. <laughs> <laughs> the ferry. The ferry. We. The ferry. The ferries. Can you believe a big hunk? Oh, can you believe a big hunk of iron like Ether Paradise can float in the sea? And it's all because of the Pokemon holding it up. Did you know that, Phantom? What? Really? They're making Pokemon Ooh, hold the whole island up. React. Oh, okay. No, he said it was a joke. Oh. oh, I can't wait to actually see inside Ether Paradise for myself. I was gonna like, say, I was like, bastards. yo, what is this? <laughs> like, Dude, can you I believe Ether that whole Paradise island? Paradise kind of has the Legends Arceus like aesthetic. What do you mean? With the, like, the golden, golden white. Ooh. Ooh. Fancy. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look how pretty it is. Ooh, banana. Here we are, you two. This is the Ether Paradise. Su, do, woo, do. Youngoos! <laughs> Up we go. Upsy daisy, someone's home. Ether Paradise is the facility created for the conversation of Pokemon. Conversation. Con conservation. <laughs> Conversations <laughs> of Pokemon. Outfitted. <laughs> it has been outfitted with all the latest technology for this purpose. Downstairs, our teams work on developing new Pokeballs and more. Yes, all for the sake of Pokemon conservation. Pokemon Though conversation. for all, will not be able to use any of your Pokeballs within Ether Paradise. A jamming signal is broadcast throughout the facility to prevent them from functioning. Wait, what's not functioning in here? 
our Pokeballs. What? They dirtied us, man. I can't believe you did this <gasps> I to know us. her. Oh my oh, goodness. There. Excuse me, Mr. Fama. Yes, excuse you. What is the meaning of this form of address? I have a title for a reason. How else will anyone know how important I am? <laughs> yeah. Branch Chief Faba. Now I must go speak with the president about our conservation efforts in Akila. Akala. Show these children around and then take them to meet the president as well. <laughs> Jinkies. Hey, the old man's gone. Let's get out. She reminds me of Velma. She does. Phew. <laughs> Welcome to Aether Paradise, DJ and Hal. My name is Wick. Is it Wick? Just Wick? Mm. Yeah, Wick. Or is it Wiki? Wiki Wiki? Wick. Wicker Wicker? Wait! I you, I, you know who we are? How'd you know that? One of our employees told me about your meeting on Akala Island. And of course I hear I heard how you helped protect the Pokemon there too, Mr. Young Mr. Howe. Thank you very mm -hmm. much. Let me show you around the main entrances above us. Okay. Okay. Hey, there's a button. Let's push it. <laughs> uh, uh, why'd she act like she never seen Whoa, it what is this doing here? <laughs> Oh, it's just the way to get out so I can go home. <laughs> uh, good stuff. Good stuff. This is the main entrance. You can have your Pokemon taken care of at the reception desk there if they need it. Oh my New god. Potter. I, I kind of forgot they had like a little cutscene where they showed little pokes dancing around. DJ, you and Hal are both trial goers, aren't you? Are you hoping to become champions? I suppose you must be around 11-ish then? How do you know? Yeah, you know I about took the, the first button. chance I had to join the island challenge once I turned 11. Sheepers. Because someday I really want to be able to beat my Gramps, but he's way too strong. So for now, I'll just enjoy my island challenge. <laughs> I can't wait to beat my Gramps like he beat me. <laughs> you, you want to talk about that for a second? How lovely so, for you. Oh, sure. Yeah, did up? you hear that Scarlet and Violet, you're going to be able to go to any gym you want at any time? Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. And then they're going to be scaled to your level, so it's kind of like... Exactly. Exactly. Uh, what is it, the Pokemon generation scene where you, they go to see Brock and Brock has six Pokemon, but he's like, oh, yep. it's your first gym battle, so I'm only going to use two? Exactly. How sick is that, that's, bro? That's how, cool. That is that's, cool. You know how much replay validability that is? Because, like, oh, you know, yeah. I want to see what this, you know what I mean? Let, let's try it in reverse. Well, here's from the, first here's time the thing, I did too. If, we, if you and I do a, a series of it when it mm -hmm. first comes out, we mm -hmm. could, like, totally play it different. But we can play together, though, is the thing. Like, we yeah. could join up I together. Can be like, and you know what, like... deal? I need to go take on, you know, I don't know what gym leaders there are yet, but I'm, I'm assuming there's going to be a grass water fire, so it could be like, you know what? I'm going to go take on the fire gym leader. Because you took the grass. Oh, or yeah, yeah, take you, the water. Yeah. Down. Maybe maybe we make it tougher on ourselves and take the ones that are strong to us and go, go with that first. Oh, that'd be fun. <laughs> right? Oh, bro, but I really... Dude, I really want Fue Coco, bro. I really want I want Fue Coco. We're gonna play rock paper scissors. I want Fue Coco with the Fue Fue. We're gonna play rock paper scissors. I suppose all children must must yearn to take a journey of their own choosing when they get to be about your age. Though you're hardly just children anymore, trainers are like parents to their Pokemon. DJ How, DJ How, <laughs> would you like to uh, see the conservation area upstairs? Here's the button again. Let's push it. I like how I didn't have a choice to be like, nah, I'm good. Nah, I'm good. Hey, let's go upstairs and look at the color. Ooh. Ah. Aether Paradise is a safe haven for all Pokemon. For this reason, we use Pokeballs as strictly forbidden within the conservation area. Hmm. Wow. Wow. We keep Pokemon that have been, target have been targeted by Team Skull here. You see? Okay, hold on. You see this action she's making right now? Mm -hmm. That is the exact same motion that your mother makes every time she talks. Every every single time. Exact same huh. thing. Fun facts. And we also try to support Pokemon that need a little extra protection. Like Corsola, for example. They are quite terribly overhunted in a, by a Pokemon called Marini. Also, Corsola turns into a ghost later. <laughs> I hope you don't mind if I read a passage from my old Pokedex. I traveled through Kanto before. <laughs> When I was a younger, when I was younger, you see, another Cantonian, huh? Corsola, hey, you, you really like Corsola, right, Mike? <laughs> in a in a Lola, where their natural enemies, Marini, is plentiful, 
Many Corsola have stubby branches on their heads. So why didn't we get a regional variant in Alola then? Hmm. Just a thought. Yeah, my Gramps is always saying that nature's got its cruel side, sure, as it gives us blessings. But can the Ether Foundation really protect all Pokemon from that out there? Mm-hmm. Nature does have its own balance, of course. It can be difficult to judge just how much humans should try to affect that, can it? That's pretty amazing. The Ether Foundation seems awesome. But why did you bother setting up a branch in a place like Alola? <sighs> Silly boy. I couldn't say. It's hard to know for for sure what our president was is thinking sometimes. If you'd like to meet President Lusamine, she should be here in a in the conservation area now. Uh oh. Pokemon Fusion confirmed. What? Oh. Alright, man. We gotta go this going way. Going this way. Oh well then I'm going this way. <laughs> <laughs> well, then I'm going that way. Sorry. Oh, I forgot you can play with the Pokemon. I don't Spin know. around. I don't know where I'm at. Oh, there is a Starmie. Hello, Starmie. Turn around. Oh, stare at it. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Starmie. This guy says, give me free stuff, man. Why don't you give me free stuff? Give me free stuff, mister. Give me free stuff in the game. Oh! I done found it. My sweet Pokemon, I promise I'll keep you safe. I'll protect you with my love. Ah. Down, 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 down. Mm hmm. You must be DJ Spinda and Hal. Welcome to the Aether Paradise, the Aether Foundation's own private island. I am the president of the foundation, but please just call me Lusamine. I'm so glad we got to meet you. I'm glad there are people like you who travel the islands to learn more about Pokemon, but there are also those unfortunate people who harm Pokemon for their own selfish reasons or even for profit. Like me. And that's why I'm here, to do exactly that. <laughs> I will be like a mother to all of the poor Pokemon and shower them with love. Even Pokemon from distant worlds, far from a Lola region, like, you know, those aliens, are worthy of my love. And of my sharing of Miss genes. Miss Lucimine, uh, I don't know how you do all this. More like, not even that much older than us. Ooh. Oh, 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 you sweet boy. <laughs> I'm already over 40. <laughs> you are? Oh, damn. Oh, my damn. Hmm. Ooh, wait, wait, what? <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> the right style does wonders, <laughs> you know. And how your style is a bit wanting, hmm? I'll have to take you out sometime and help you pick out some smashing outfit um, oh she's australian i wonder some smashing outfit <laughs> <laughs> she talks smashing. like nigel <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah, she... mm, smashing yeah. like what you hear i don't think anyone else can pull off that kind of look except maybe <gasps> Lily. oh my god what's happening here <sighs> oh don't worry you just leave everything up to me trust me children would all would all be much happier if they'd only listen to the adults around them. What's going on? Oh my gosh, it's a break-in. Look at me, I'm just like blissfully unaware. Derp. Hmm. That tremor, did something happen in the lower floors? <laughs> Jinkies. Oh shoot, we have an ultra battle. Oh my god. Dude, Dude we're always. 20 minutes in and we haven't done anything but read dialogue. Yeah, kind of gnarly. <laughs> I know this, story, this whole story for Ultra Sun and Ultraman was just kind of gnarly. Bro, I, I dug it. I, I really wish I wouldn't have played the regular Sun and Moon. Yeah, yeah, I feel that. What is it? What's this Pokemon's name? Ne Negalito or Negaliato mm -hmm. or something? Negalia. Is that what it is? Oh my god, there it is. Mm. You are. Have you come from a distant world? Aliens. Then oh, no. Vima 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 no. Vima
Miss Lucimine, stand back. That thing's not right. <laughs> it's kind of crazy that it's a rock type. Yeah, right? You poor creature. You have yet to be fused with a person. You poor creature. No way. Dude, I wonder if the other ones... You know what I mean? Like, I wonder if, like, Buzz will confuse with somebody. Yeah, that'd be kind of nutty. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, we, bo we both got little birdies! Bird? <laughs> Crazy strong Chatot appeared. <laughs> Lady Bird! Lady Bird! The, the dreaded Chatot. Go Kane! I totally forgot I led with my dragon fighting type. Bro, I'm taking this thing out, bro. 1v Curry Dog, it's over. I'm gonna go into Quick. First, I'm gonna fire fang it. Quick Silver. Double slap, how dare you? Ah. He's slapping ah. you right in the face. Ah. Next time we do a randomizer, we're gonna do randomized abilities. Uh oh. <laughs> Just for funsies. Yeah, more things to break in my game. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's. In ah, I can just do another fire thing. Double slap. Oof, oh, I one shot it. Holy <laughs> Toledo. <laughs> fire thing. Sova, dog. Sova. Get out of here, Tweety. <laughs> Get out of here, Tweety. Get out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dude, that is creepy. Oof, oof. Fading in and out Dude, of Dude, that existence. was nutty, bro. It died just like a Digimon. The unidentified creature disappeared. It's called a Nagalia. I read its name. So it's true. I still need that Pokemon. I need to get it back. Uh, Miss, Miss Lucimine, <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> are you okay? Mm, I'm smashing why so shocked. Huh. Was this your first time seeing an mm, ultra beast? Those mysterious creatures that live beyond the ultra wormholes, the holes that suddenly open in the sky and lead to ultra space. <laughs> it would serve you well to remember this. <laughs> Who the seriously, what's with you that get up? <laughs> what's with that get up? These are my guests, the Ultra Requan Requan Squad. The Ultra Requan Squad. <laughs> <laughs> they have been given the foundation advice. Of the Ultra Beast, Ultra Lord! <laughs> Why don't you introduce yourselves? <laughs> ultra Lord! <laughs> so, so we meet again, trial goer! <laughs> the Ultra Recon Squad is, well, as the name suggests, a group that investigates Ultra Wormholes and Ultra Beasts. This is Captain Psycho, and I am Soliria. Ultra and Wormholes! I'm Zozy. <laughs> and I'm Zozy! <laughs> I am Winona! Dude. A world of darkness without light. <laughs> a world with darkness without light is a world in the darkness. This is a creature known as Necrozma. Necrozma. This is. Oh wait, who is it that's actually talking? Oh yeah, that's her. This is able to bestow light upon others, but now it runs wild beyond reason. We call it the Blinding One out of respect, but I fear that the day may come when Alola loses its light to Necrozma. Necrozma. <laughs> But everything will be fine. <laughs> if the necros, if this necrozma or any ultra beast like the one we just saw should come to this world, I'm gonna smack him in the teeth. From an <laughs> the Aether Foundation will be prepared to smack them in the teeth. Rest easy; you will not need to worry about a thing. Especially because we I, have ultra. I Lord. like Psycho. <laughs> Wick. These two are still in the middle of their island challenge, aren't they, Nudge Nudge? Please deliver them to their next island, Nudge Nudge. Oh, um, at once, ma'am, jinkies. <laughs> I will go back to that one where the poor resident Pokemon came to any harm. And I need to speak with Mr. Faba about exactly what happened downstairs. It may be our experiments to open an ultra wormhole are not going as well as we'd hoped. Uh, I'll see the two of you to Ula Ula Island then. Oh my gosh, Dylan, our third island. Oh man. my god. This is the. He's, this he is, said, call me. We need to call this episode, um. Uh. Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, the movie. <laughs> yeah. Because that's literally what it is. Mm. I never thought I'd actually get to see the Ultra Wormhole in my life. Never mind, meeting people from another world, man, the surprise just never stopped coming. We've got to tell Professor Byrne about this the next time we see her. 
I'm glad you feel that way. What happened here today was a surprise to all of us. Well, but I was very glad to get to meet you both. Please take this to remember the visit. Some malasadas for how? What? <laughs> some humanam, some hakuna, some, some hakuna isn't matadas. Isn't it crazy how masalaga tastes even better when eaten, eaten together with someone else? Yeah, I think I know what you mean. <laughs> Meals always taste better when you share them with the ones you love, like your boyfriend over here. And mm -hmm. for you, DJ, a TM, the move psychic. God, it ain't gonna be psychic. It's gonna be tackle. Here we go. Hurricane, let's go. Oh, Hurricane. Oh, dude. Dude, if, if, you throw that on Pidgeot, oh, bro. if Pidgeot can learn it, I'm gonna be flipping out. I hope you both have a wondrous adventure on your island challenge. We will. Hello, Thanks, Miss Wick. <laughs> Alright, how many freaking The Angel Recon Oh my god. Ho! Oh, oh. My heart's still kind of racing, you know? <laughs> ho! Lion, ho! The Ultra Wormhole is real. The Ultra Beast are real too. Yeah! <laughs> and now this Ultra Recon Squad 2. This world is just way too big. I bet we'll discover even more new things on the next island too. We're gonna need all the energy we can get. Time to dig in. Nom 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 nom. Mmm, my Akuna Matata is delicious. These cheeseburgers are great. <laughs> you want some malasada? Want, want a bite? Oh, so good. Shoot, I already ate the whole thing. Damn, what a pig. Dude, look at all that room. There ain't no way in hell they're on a plane. <laughs> right? Like, oh, the plane. Mm, you want to lay down and sleep in the sleeper Dude, cabin I, of the plane? Dude, I, I totally seen that they were offering $200 for bigger seats. Dang, on an airplane. Two, son. And guess how four inches, dude, of extra free movement. <laughs> four whole inches? What are you gonna do with all that? Yeah, I hate that shit. It's, I just go sit on a damn emergency exit. Hey, there you go. <laughs> Arr, <Landry. laughs> mm hmm Land ahoy. Alright, terra firma under the foot again. Mm -hmm. We're gonna run into Lily Step now. On a tour tear. Ula right. Ula Island is another totally different place than Mele Mele or Akula, huh? I actually really like. We're this supposed island. to meet up with the professor, right? Where was Mally Garden? Hmm. We'd want to to we'd want us to go to the garden. Guess we'll find. Dude, there's so many battles in that garden. It's kind of nuts. Oh, oh my god. god. We've made it to Ula Island now, <laughs> and that means another big island Pokedex for you, big boy filler up. Pokemon, what we do. I'm gonna actually save my game just because I, I yeah, would hate if something crashed my game for some stupid reason. I had to go through all that again. Yep. Um what what time are we at, my man? We're at like twenty eight minutes. I found a total. I'm gonna edit this. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm really gonna edit all of the talking. Bro, we had some fun dialogue in there. I put all my heart and soul into that. That sucked. The recon squad. We ultra weak punch wide. I can't say ultra recon recon squad. I can't. It's quan every time. Ultra okay. weak punch squad. I can't do it. Dude, another technical machine shop, bro. A Nature's madness Nature's present. Tail glow. Tail glow, Dylan. Ooh, Draco meteor, bro. Oh, that's dope, too. Uh, okay, I got a horn leech. <laughs> horn leech is kind of broken, though. Yeah. A joke. <laughs> I'll have to come back to that. I don't have an awful lot of money. I'm going to heal. Money? Money. Yeah, yeah, we got the money. Money. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, we have a little bit of time. Do you want to try to snag a quick encounter before we go? Or? Yeah, why not, bro? You know, is that... Well, I mean, I'm, I'm editing the video, bro. We're going to have plenty of time. Oh, I see. You're going to cut out all my hard work that I put in just now. Oh, my God. All of my hard idea, work. Come on, let's have a battle. Oh, we got a battle? Oh, yeah. All snap. right, well, guys, this is the end of the episode. This will be the end of the episode. All right. Go ahead. Uh, I, I gotta, I'm gonna swap my team around. I'm gonna put Bay up front again because I just wanna try to get more levels on the little guy. Mm -hmm. And if it's something that I can actually fight, I'm just gonna drag and tail it out of there and switch anyway. Let's do it! Let's do it, 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 do it. Which cast? Oh my god, I would cry. <laughs> I would literally oh, die. This great. is a team of six, bro! Kendra. 
Oh, bro. Stoutland! Why'd you lead with the one Pokemon? Hmm. That's a level 30 Stoutland. That is an entire Stoutland right there. Please don't have Ice Beam. Oh, that'd be terrible. Yeah, bro, that'd ruin me. Oh, oh no! Is it dragon or water? I hope it's water. Uh, I can't be dragon. Water. Could be dragon. How much damage is this gonna do? I don't know. It resisted pretty good. Eat it up! Oh, I gotta work up uh, Stoutland out here. Kind of, kind of, kind of low key scary right there. Mm. Can we get a Zen headbutt flinch? Whoop. Bop. Oh, okay. he roared me out. Oh, okay, this works because now I can yeah, intimidate. Teeter dance. <laughs> teeter dance. Dancing, dancing, dancing. Quick attack! Dancing, Take him out. Dancing, dancing. Oh, he he withdrew Stoutland. What? Went into Excadrill, dude. He's playing to win. Play to win. He's literally playing to win right now. Live to fall. Cool. I guess Tina's kind of my only play here. Actually, Excadrill right, kind of... Dance. Excadrill kind of rocks my team. No pun intended. Hone Claws. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did you... Oh, my Lanta. Oof. Okay, okay, we got ourselves a fight on our hand here, Mike. Yeah, tell me Double that, Hone Claws, Mike! Dylan. 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 Oh, and I wasted a turn sand attacking him because Hone Claws is just not. Like, Bro, you have nothing. You have I, nothing. I have nothing for an Excadrill with Don't, Hone Claws. No, dude, you were gonna kill- Oh, dude, if he kills- Bro, if he kills- Metal Claw, he went Metal Claw. If he kills Tina, I'm, I'm boned. Okay, I got a plan. I'm gonna go. He's not gonna use a. He's not gonna use a ground type move with Tina out there. I'm gonna switch into Megatron and I'm gonna Magnet Rise. Okay. Cause then I'm covered. Cause Steel Rock, anything like that is not gonna do anything to Megatron. But if, if he reads me in like Earthquakes here, okay, he went Metal Claw. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, that actually did a lot. <laughs> More than I thought. It didn't too much. Okay, I outspeed. I go Magnet Rise. That gives me a what, like four or five turns of. Levitation, basically. Oh, I and he really went dig. Need. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Um. Shoot. I'm kind of. I'm just gonna heal. Cause I can't do. Any, I'm not gonna. I, I would outspeed him, but I'm just gonna miss. So I'm just gonna heal here. And I should be able to avoid that dig. Double home claws dig, which is terrifying, beyond belief. Okay. Let's try for a Zen headbutt. Flinch. Ooh, God, I did damage. Triple Hone Claws. That is three up right now. I'm still protected from Magnet Rise. Zen headbutt should knock out here. Okay. Woo! <laughs> Dang, that thing is scary, bro. That thing is scary straight up. Yikes. That was a big yikes. I'm gonna stay in on this. I'm just gonna bullet punch because he's almost dead. Yeah. Oh, it had to be a mega hair <laughs> across, bro. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. V create should knock out, huh? I'm so, well, it's gonna lower my defenses, so I'm gonna fire fang for all oh, dude. V would 100% oh. knock yeah, out. Yeah, oh, we'll please. Win. Oh, it doesn't have guts. Thank God. Break, break. Oh, dude, I got him. He's done, though. Yeah, you can just You're lucky fire fang again. Man. Hopefully, he doesn't miss. No, fire fang is 100. percent I could have sworn that all the fangs were lower accuracy. 35, bro. One more level, bro, and I'll have a damn. Uh, you know. I'll Let's have hope this is a regular it. Grimer. Regular old Grimer. There we go. I'm a ninja dog. <laughs> Then headbutt, one shot, no shot, let's go. What if this thing's Protean or Battle Bond? What, yeah, what if it's Ash Greninja? That's what I'm saying. Oh yeah, Battle Bond, true, 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 true. Oh, you God. won't know though until after if it's Battle Bond or not. 
No, well, I mean, it could just come out Battle Bond. Oh, that's true, but it didn't. Uh, Monferno. Oh, I messed up bad. It might have Aerial Ace. Oh, it could. It definitely could. I see it, though. I'm gonna stay in. I should be able Dude, to. Dude, I have really high defenses in, but... with this thing, though. I'm gonna increase my speed and increase my defense. He's just spiking me out, throwing throwing stuff on the field. Monferno. <laughs> Rose is actually a battle, guys. This is actually a battle. Duosion. Um, this is actually a battle. I don't have an awful lot for Duosion. I think I'll just go Quicksilver. Bro, Quiver Dance is actually really broken. I need to update. Um, I need to update Metric moveset. Can you only do spikes, bro? Oh, that he, dude, he's of... laying the battle down. He wants he wants whoever comes out next to get hurt real bad. <laughs> that wants to get hurt real bad. Shadow Stick. Oh, he has Endeavor. Oh, Let's see. that's gonna be a problem. Let's see if it's a Ghost type. Nope. Okay, it's Torrent. Thank God. Oh, I one shot? Oh my god. Alright, no fire types, no more bug types, bro. Next, I'll come a fire bug type. <laughs> Dude, All Corona. Corona. I'm oh, there's a bug Spinarak. type. <laughs> Better than Ari, though. Sorry, though, would actually be a little bit scary. Spinner yeah, not so much. Gosh, oh, I won. I'm done with mine. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Woo wee. Suck a punch. You know mm -hmm. what, DJ Spinda? You should just take this Lycium Z, too. Oh my god. It came as a set with those big masahalajajaj that Miss Wick gave us when you plan on adding any Lycanroc to your team or anything. I I would love to add a Lycanroc to my team. Yeah. I seen you got a shiny, uh... Yeah, and, and shiny Pogo, little let's go. Yeah, can it, So when... Can you decide who it evolves into? I, I already evolved it. Yeah, day and night. It? I, if you evolve it after, like, 6 or 7 p.m., it evolves into midnight form. Oh, do they have dust form on there, or no? You can. I don't exactly know how to get it, actually. I think it has something to pick? do with making it your buddy. I, I did midnight form in yeah. the shiny midnight form. It was just dope. It's just too cool. You yeah. and your partner Pokemon looked and they're having a blast, DJ. I guess it's like my gramp said. Go beyond plus ultra. Oh. <laughs> Winning and losing. Dude, and speaking to of that, find bro, I wa started Gen watching that yesterday. Oh, finally, huh? Let's go. It's good. It is good. I like it. I mean, it's... I like it. I would really like it if they, if I could watch it seamlessly without like all the intros, all the outros, all the flashbacks, mm -hmm. all the return twos, and this and that. Like they could just mm -hmm. give me straight content over and over and over and over again. If someone would just cut the show and post it all in like a, you could watch the whole the whole you could watch a whole season in an hour and a half, like an entire yeah. season in an hour and a half if you cut out all the BS and just pff, one thing after another. It's totally a waste to just throw Zora out without you know. <laughs> yeah, right. I need to see if I got some good special moves to teach Manetric because right now. Did you see if Hurricane could go on? I haven't checked it yet. I, I really need. That's that's is that special or is that physical? That's physical, right? I'm pretty positive that's physical. If it's physical, it'd be great on. On. Uh... Oh, it is special. It is special, and I can learn it. On Yo, you better get rid of Tina. Uh, Gust. Yeah, for sure. It just sucks. Like my physical is 73, my special is 57. So I mean, yeah. there's that. But still gonna be better than Gust. Oh, well, if he evolve, if he can Mega evolve, he's and, special attacker. And it can cause confusion. Mm -hmm. All right, we won our battle. Thank goodness. I need a better Grass type move. Physical bug move. Cool. All right, you guys. Well, we're going to end it here. If you guys did enjoy this episode. Oh! Oh, too soon. You spoke too soon, That's Mike. That's what it is, bro. That's what it is, bro. Give it to me. Give it to me. I'm worth it. There he is, man. Mm-hmm. Incineroar. Right on, man. Cha-ching. Cha-ching, cha-ching, cha There it goes. All right, man. 
We're gonna eat it there. Oh, I'm learning. Oh, oh I'm yeah, learning. Darkness Lariat, right? Yeah, oh, yeah, that's Lariat. right. Oh, man, that's Actually, good. You just, add, you just added another dark type to your squad, bro. Bro, let me get a double kick, bro. Right on. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be the, the end for us, finally. Unless I have another evolution coming up, which I don't think I do. But that's pretty dope. All right, guys. Well, I've been the Phantom Michael. That's DJ Spender. We're going to get the heck out of here, and we will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.